Hello, in this video we are going to see how you can add multiple pages to your uh, nice guy application. In the past I've created a video that will introduce you to nice guy and what it has to offer and in this video we are going to see exactly how you can add multiple pages to your nice guy. So in here for instance I have an example of these applications that you see that uh, you have a header in this area and here you have the content. If you click the menu in here you will have multiple pages and if you are navigating to the page you will have the design with the header and the footer that will be consistent between the, the moves. So yeah, in this uh, video we are going to see exactly how you can uh, do this in uh, Nice Guy. If you didn't see my previous video that introduces you to Nice Guy, please uh, go ahead and check the description. I will let a link in, in there. I've also created an article with all of these things that we need to do because we need to do some some things to be able to have these uh, multiple pages created in uh, Nice Guy. And in here you will find everything that uh, that you need. And also I've created a repository with all of uh, this thing. Uh, if you want to check it in uh, GitHub, you can do go in here and uh, check it. And uh, yeah, let's get started and see how we can add multiple pages to our nice guy application. So I have in the left side in here a uh, nice guy um, folder where I have only the main that PI that we are going to update and create all of the things that we need. All the pages it will be stored in a uh, page folder and uh, in this way you can uh, be more flexible and add your things in, in there and don't have a lot of files in the main uh, ones. So let's go and uh, check the articles and I will uh, just create the files and explain you what all of these things are doing. Also you can check my article for more explanation if you, if you want. So the first thing that we are going to create is the MPI file. So basically what this will do, it will create the layout for everything that all the pages will use. I just get started with uh, nice guy and uh, I saw that there are not a lot of tutorials that can help you. So that's why I've started this series that uh, will help you go into nice guy and uh, make a nice design. So let's go and uh, check this so you need to have the nice guy installed again you can check my previous video if you want to see all the details so in this area you see that you have a context manager that it's used by nice guy and in here we are importing the menu that will just create and in here you are importing nice guy and in this area you see for instance you have a frame that will keep the details you have the colors you will have the column with the yield in here that will add all the details for the elements of the page. In here we added a uh, header. You see in here that the header it's added. You have a button in there that uh, is the hamburger one. You have the options to change the, the colors if you want in here. We have added a footer. We have added a left drawer. This is the actual sidebar. And uh, yeah, we made it uh, sticky. So yeah, this is the, the code that uh, you are just need to add for your uh, team uh, file. So I will just uh, save this, this code right now. Next, we're going to move and create the second uh, file. The second file will be the one that will held our menu that is imported in here. So we are just going to create a menu.pi. New file, menu.pi. And in this one, we are just going to import again nice guy and we are just going to add our menu. Basically, these are the pages that we are going to, to use. So you see in here that I have defined a class and in here you have the link for the home page. You have the text for the, for the link that it will be black in my case. And I've added two pages with the UI link element, you have the YouTube title and the YouTube script generators. You can add as many as you like. And the only thing that this is doing is just adding a text to the menu with a text black. So this is the second file that we need to create that will held our menu with all the pages that we want to, to add. So I've saved this. Then we'll create a folder called pages. And in here we'll create our two pages for this uh, demonstration. So we're gonna create a new folder. Let me put it like pages and let's go and uh, create the, the file. So basically this will be the pages that uh, you have and in here you can put your nice guy elements, functions and things like that. The first one it will be title generator for YouTube. 
and I'll create a file in here. Title generator, it's called. And in here we have the code. This is just to demonstrate you. It has some basic elements. So you see in here that I'm just importing the, the theme from the from the project. This is the file that we've just created. I'm importing nice guy. And in here you define the function. And in here you have the theme.frame that will hold everything. And uh, you will be sure that you have the consistent modular design. And in here I've just added a page title and uh, an UI markdown with, uh, with a header, hash one header. This, this is just to demonstrate you. you can add all the things you want in here. We are going to extend this application in the future with the length chain and create some uh, AI applications that uh, will help us. So I will just save this. And the other thing that we need to do is to add the second page. It will be the script generator and I will add a new file in here. And the same in here, I'm just creating the page with some uh, elements. Again, we'll create a function and in here and we add the elements. The only thing that is different in here is the name. This is the name for the script generator. I will hit save. So right now we've created the pages. The next thing that we're going to do, it will need to create a file that will be called the pages.pi. And basically this will have a function in here that will fetch the details from the files and it will just uh, create the page elementary, the UI page. Let's go and create it. Let me put in here and I will create a new file. It will call all pages. So this will keep all the pages. This is to have like a modular approach for, for this. And what this thing it's doing is just importing the nice guy. It's importing the pages of title generator and the script generator. And here it's importing the, the function. And in here I will just create the, the page. You see that in here I have the UI.page and with the function that I've imported and I will create everything at the end. This is from their documentation. The code, I didn't create it myself in the example of uh, next guy. You can see all of these, these things. I've just made it uh, more modular with pages folder and things like that. So you have a better structure to your project. You can also edit the GitHub project if you have more knowledge into Python and things like that. And in here I will create the homepage. So basically this will be the homepage that uh, will hold everything. So I will create a file called homepage, homepage.pi. And uh, this one is just uh, adding the content to our uh, first page. I've just added some markdown text in here to show you how it's looking. Again, in here you see that uh, we have a function with the content. We have a UI column and UI markdown that it's having our text. You can add your text in, in here in the way you, you like. This is just to demonstrate how you can create multiple pages with nice guy. And uh, right now we reach the part where we need to update the main.pi, the main file. Right now it's blank, it doesn't have anything. And in here we are just going to add this code and let's go and see what it's doing. So this is importing the whole page, it's importing the home page, it's importing the team, it's importing the nice guy, it's importing the app and the UI. And in here you have the UI page and uh, this is from the home page that it was just uh, created. In here it will just create the, 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 the pages. And in here you will have the UI run title getting started with nice guy. You can put what title you, you want. I will hit save for this. And uh, this should be enough to create a multiple layout into nice guy. So right now what we'll need to, to do is just to go and start this thing. So what we'll do, it will just run python3 main.pi. Okay, I see it has an error in here. I need to add something like this. I will modify also the code so you have it. So let's start this again. So right now you see that the nice guy started and in here you have the design. So this is the elements that you added in the home page. And let's make this bigger so you can see exactly what is happening. So like this, it will look on the desktop. This should be responsive. And in here you have the menu. Of course, you can add your menu elements also in the, in the header, but I will keep these things for now simple. And in here you have the menu and in here you see that you have the name that you put it for the, for the menu. You have the home page, you have the YouTube titles. You see that the link is pointing to the YouTube title generator. And in here you have, this is my title generator page. The title we have set, you have the title that is set in the browser. For the script generator, it will be the same, it will point you to the YouTube script page that we've created. You have the title in, in here. If you go to home, it will just go to your home page. And this design should be responsive off of the box. You see that 
it should look nice on the mobile. And if you go like this, you have all the pages in here. You have a footer that we are going to update with some elements for our application. And yeah, in this way, you are adding the multiple pages to your nice guy. Again, all of these details have been fetched from the repository. I let a link into the description. So in here, you have the nice guy example with all the details. And in here, they have like the modularization. And in here, you see that you will see some of these files. And uh, yeah, I've just modified the code uh, slightly to look nicer and to have some additional elements in the in the team folder. Also, I've created the pages. Again, you can check also my repo in uh, in here with a lot of the, the details. You can also contribute to this repo if you are like an expert in Nice Guy. Uh, I'm just getting started with uh, Nice Guy and with uh, with. Python. I'm not an expert in this, but yeah, I want to share the experience for the ones that are beginners and maybe they want to build an uh, UI to their Python application. I like Nice Guys because it's uh, it's fast and it has a lot of flexibility. And yeah, if you know how to use it properly, it will help you create nice Python applications. I will let uh, the link into the description to the Nice Guy playlist. So I will add all the videos that I will create in the future in in there thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed the the video if you have something to add please drop a comment into the the video so others can can know again i'm not an expert in uh, nice guy and uh, python so the, if there are mistakes they can be corrected and we can update this repo with all of details and my uh, my article thanks for watching and see you in the next video in uh, nice guy where we'll add some ai elements to enhance our getting started application